Hello guys, um, what is up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to add your scratch game to Game Jolt. And I can actually show you like, sometimes you don't have the dashboard and sometimes I won't let you post your project. I will also help with that at the same time. So this is me, my template file is going to be the template for today is going to be maze what you will actually be able to play on my account but basically what I'm going to be doing is is showing you how I do it and how you how you can turn a scratch file into uh, a zip file for the to be able to publish it Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go in your project and go to File. And there's New, Save Now, Save Copy. We aren't going to do any of that. We're going to look down at Load and Save to your computer. And we're going to actually save to computer. There we go. It is downloaded. And this is the part that all you can search. Yes, I have mine right here. Uh you should go to search s i mean h t m l a fire let me just make sure it actually works though So yeah, if you search it in right, you can go to this and uh, that. So you have this. I'm going to. Cho you're gonna choose a file, and I'm gonna choose. Go for the one that it downloaded. So mine's maze dot as b3. Right here. And then right here, just name it whatever you want. Ma maze. And then you can just delete that. Tab icon. We don't have to worry about that because we can just add a picture. You don't. You can mess with this if you want. Like there's a full screen button. I don't want that for mine. Automatically, yes. You can change the loading color. Um. Since I don't have a background image, I'll just make it black so you can't see it. So, what image do you want while the project loads? We don't have to worry about that. What should be stretched? You can stretch as if you want. I'm actually going to stretch it. Cursor style, you can do. Use the default cursor. You can hide the cursor. That's what I'm going to do. And then we don't have to worry about all of this, so we can just go down. And right here, do not immediately press that. We gotta create a zip file instead. First. Okay, so uh, mine downloaded. I press download again just in case. So now I have add a game, but you can just search at you search. Add game and then you just search game jolt and then press in and now you're in. So if yours is early access, you can do that and this is complete and stable. Do early access if it is not complete but if it is complete do complete and stable title of the game so I'm gonna name it maze then we're gonna go to the URL path 
You want to go back to your project. And copy. Wait. So I was wrong. You enter your own. I'm going to name it Maze. Maze game website that's optional. Um, no, this. Um, if you want a free game, stop that and if like put it on red. And if you don't want to give them a 10% cut of sales, also go like that. So, oh, wait. Oh yeah, 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 you have to go to an engine, and for scratch, you go all the way down till the till it's in between Ruby and Spear. So after you got that, click Save and Next. Game tags. This is your description. I'm gonna write. So here's mine. Um, mine will just go in the other and puzzle. Then you press save and next again. Now this is your game header. For this, I'm just gonna go cheap on it. So hold on. So um, I'm gonna blur all this part out. So like, see you guys. So I just set mine to be an umbrella for the thumbnail. You don't have to do this. For my color theme, it's going to be blue and purple. And about here, package name, yeah. It can be public, but I'm gonna write free and click add package. And then you don't, since you don't have a release on here, you gotta do new release. Version 0 0.1.0, 0, yep. And then upload browser build. You don't have to do this, but you do have to do this. So that's where we are going to choose our file, maze.zip. It's going to get everything ready. Fit to screen, yes, fit to screen. Save build. Now that's done. Um, then you can publish your release. And then you can go to that. We're going to do all ages. All of this is none. There's no violence. So press save. And, um,. You gotta go back to packages, manage, next step, I'm pretty sure you. This is what gets. This is what gets me all the time. So this game is public.
think I want you to test your game first. Save release. There you go. So you, I didn't realize this, but you have to edit release and you have to save your release. So then you can press public, I mean publish. That, and then uh, you can go to your game library, uh, go to your games. You can go, I'm gonna go to maze. And you gotta go to s manage game thing. Let me search it up. Maze and games. So mine is not up there yet. You have to go to your um. So it has currently gotten no downloads, no views. So I assume it's on. There is a trailer to this game. But, yeah, you just did it. Uh, I'm just, just going to show you that it works. You press play game. Might not work for me, though, because these types of files are bad when you, um, Use it like you'll be able to see the player, but I can't see the player for some reason. There you go. You finished what you did, and yeah, I'll be seeing you guys in the next one. Peace.